two summers ago, I was sexually assaulted by a friend or someone who I considered a friend. And I was really struggling with myself. I didn't exactly feel like I could be safe anymore. I felt like I had no control over the protection of my own body. I had talked to my uncle because I was living with him at the time. He found Project Hope for me. Project Hope exists to help an individual on their journey to healing. Project Hope is willing to go deep, to work with people who hurt as, as deep in their souls as a person can hurt. So I was seriously considering suicide. Um, it felt like the only option at the time. I mean, I didn't feel like I was getting support really anywhere. We're all humans. We all need to be connected to one another. And I think that these survivors oftentimes don't have those connections. And Project Hope, with its staff and its volunteers, is willing to step in that, right in the middle of it, and help comfort and to be there when the person hurts the most. Without Project Hope, I don't think I would have made it this far. I really don't. I'm so thankful for everybody who's been here. And nonprofits only exist because of the largesse of donors, of people who have giving hearts. Every dollar makes a huge difference. We wouldn't be able to help as many people as we do without that money and without that support. When someone gives to the Community Foundation, it's an investment in the people who live in this valley. It's an investment in today, it's an investment in tomorrow.